Hello and good morning, and welcome back to DraftCraft. We have a lot of exciting stuff planned for today, so go ahead and stick around and enjoy the video. Alright, so today we are starting out at our mob farm. The mob farm we built last episode. This big old behemoth, it looks pretty cool. You can see I've actually added some redstone lamps to the top. Those are so we can control uh, spawning, and if I need to go inside, I don't die. Because that did happen a couple times while I was tweaking the farm in between videos. Speaking of tweaking the farm, we made us some small changes. We'll go up inside real quick. It's a little dark in here, sorry, bear with me. But as you can see, we have this little piston rotating thing that causes spiders not to clog the system, as well as... Uh, so well, it's still managing to clog it a little bit, but as well as some magma blocks here just to try to knock them down a little bit. You know, even if they are stuck by a spider, they should be able to give us their drop still. And it's been pretty successful. As you can see, we have a couple chests here from not too much AFKing, as well as, you know, the, the stuff going on here. So we have a lot of stuff, and I don't really need a lot of this. I don't need this many bones. I don't need, I mean, I, I do need this much gunpowder, to be honest. Don't need any of these arrows. Don't need this much string. Don't need all of this. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a shop. Everyone's favorite thing, we're going to bolster the economy and add a shop to the server. I'm very excited for this. I have a plan in mind. So we're going to head over to the shopping district and see if we can stake a claim to a spot for us. Welcome to our lovely little shopping district. We've already explored some of the shops here. There's a new one that's popped up and some other ones being built. So we need to go ahead and stake our claim quickly to ensure we get a good prime real estate next to the portals that just happen to exist right here. Um, I want a place along the initial path. And what we can do is we can actually, I was going to say we can extend this path but there's there's stuff here and here so i don't want to extend it and you know ruin their shops um we can extend it in this direction though i think those are path building supplies but i'm not certain i don't want to take them without being sure we have maggie claim there all right why is everyone claiming in the direct path of the path it's a bit annoying all right well we can go ahead we'll make this work we'll make it work we can go and extend this out a little bit this way we'll extend it along here and out that way to ensure that it is ample space we'll build along one of the sides of the path here so i'm gonna go and get on that it's nothing too special just placing some path blocks i don't know if i'm gonna worry about these whole things right now but you know, i like how there's little trash can along the path i think it's really cute all right but i'm honestly feeling a little lazy this morning we're gonna go ahead and buy some of the materials we're going to need for both the build and the path. So we have a couple deep slate in here. We'll need some stacks of that. Oh, ooh, trips don't need. I also noticed they sell. Oh, they're sold out. Never mind. <laughs> they were selling. We got our diamonds. We don't have a ton of them, so we got to be smart. So two stacks and a site for a diamond. We'll buy four stacks. So we two diamonds. All right. We don't need granite. We don't need smooth basalt. We don't need calcite. Don't need tough. Don't need sand. Don't need... We do need... We'll buy a... Well, I guess we'll buy two stacks. I only need one, but you know deep slate we need this so this is one stack i'm gonna buy two should be enough all right now i need a lot of dirt do they sell dirt i don't think they sell dirt so that means we're gonna have to go collect dirt that's fun well hmm, i have an idea oh <laughs> my idea isn't gonna work all right we're gonna go collect some dirt i'll be back Mob Mart is done and open for business. Uh, I still need to put some dead bushes around here and I need to clean up my chests, but you know, that's just minor work. So on the inside we have half a stack for a diamond for string, two stacks for a diamond for arrows, one stack for two diamonds for bones, uh, nine stacks for one diamond because it's rotten flesh. There's nothing in this one. And then this is just free with purchase because they are all just extras. Um, let me know what you guys think of the prices. I still want to toy with them a little bit. Bones is kind of what I'm most on the fence about. String is kind of hard for my farm to get, so I'm like, half a stack for diamond seems reasonable-ish. Uh, two stacks for one diamond for arrows because no one really needs them. <laughs> Everyone needs bones, so that's why they're the highest price. And rotten flesh is rotten flesh, and some people might get some use out of it. I don't know. But yeah, that's the shop. I need to clean this up here because it's a big old mess. I got a card pumpkin with the... We got that off, that data pack going. But yeah, uh, that's that. All right, so I did a little bit of mining to a bunch of mountains, and which is really good for mining iron, like over 150, like Y level 150. You'll find a lot of iron. This was only like maybe 10, 15 minutes of iron mining. Not too bad. So it's two and a half stacks. We're going to see how much we get with mining it with our pick.
All right, so two and a half stacks of ore gave us just roughly double that amount in raw iron. So that's pretty good. It'll actually really help us out for our next project, which is an expansion to our industrial district, focusing on an automatic wood farm. I'm very excited for it. I really like the fresh job. Sorry. I'm, let me swing by my shop real quick. I know for a fact I made a couple diamonds. You did. Yeah, diamonds, money. I like money. Money is good. Oh, even more money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I made something right next bite. What? Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> What type of shop is it? Craft or sleep? Is this a game? No, it's just for, it's not really a shop. It's because I know a lot of people get really annoyed because they can shop and buy something. Oh! They need shop, or they, they don't need shop. They craft or they- I love that. Is there another chest in here yet? Uh, no, I'm about to put one later. Where would you like it? Um, I think maybe right here. Okay, there is one now. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Thank you. Welcome. I'm gonna put these in Actually, here for safekeeping. Oh, I don't need thank you so much. I really don't want to go netherite mining. I know. <laughs> I'm waiting. At me and uh, who is it? Me and Spencer need to be on at the same time, so they have a template they're gonna let me clone. Oh, here, what? just use this one. You want to make a clone of it? I, yeah, go I, ahead. How do you make a clone of it? I actually don't remember. It's uh, oh, do you have any netherrack on you? Not on me, no. But the nether is right there. Yeah. Oh wait, let, let me grab some. Wait, give me the us. give me the template because if you die, those burn. Oh, oh, oh! If they yeah. if you die with them on you, it just goes yeah. away. Yeah. No, like if you die in lava. Oh, okay, good point. <clears throat> We're gonna get ourselves some netherrack. Netherrack. Oh, I left for good match. I don't know how much you need. Oh. I broke the ladder. Oh no, I broke the ladder. Stakes were made. No, stay away. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. Ah. All right, we got some spare materials. Hello. Oh, iron to wall. I really went with all my diamonds in there. Oh, I really need to get rid of this chest monster here. Hi, I'm back. Oh, hello. I didn't I die. The... All right, let's see if I remember how to do this off the top of my head. It's I do seven not. And... Ah, here we go. Thank you. And you just have to keep making clones of it, right? Yep. Okay, I'm here for now. Do that later. You want to go see my ship? Yes, that's, that's where I was going next. All right. Hello. So oh. you can either go down the waterfall and in. Oh, I just broke. Oh. Or you can go down the ladder. The ladder might be easier. <laughs> hello. So we got diamond armor. Three diamonds per item. All right. Pretty, pretty good deal. It's all enchanted. Diamond tools. One diamond per. All right. Love it. And shulker boxes, which is what I'm here for. Two diamonds per shulker box. One, two, three, five. Lovely. Thank you. Hell, one uh, diamond. True. I, I think I'm good with the five shulker boxes for now. That should be enough no, to get me going. No. Yes. Because okay. a lot of people have like extra shells. Like a spare from, shulker like, shell. End True. Oh. oh, careful. Hello. I'm alive. <laughs> all right. Oh, thank you. When is someone going to open a golden carrot shop? That's all I need to know. Um, I'm actually about to open one a little bit later. I'm gonna make a little Exciting. heart right next to X thing. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm start building my next homage. shop soon. <laughs> You need me to do some armor stands for it. I'm more than willing. Ooh, the frog looks so nice. Did it, is that slime? Frog oh, I thought that was shop. an interior. Okay. Oh, uh, here's the interior. Frog and tadpole breeding chamber. Oh, but oh, well, they do in fact have frogs here. Wow. If we are out of stock of a frog you want, please leave a request. How many diamonds it cost? There's frogs no for sale. Oh. I entered and though it was definitely. I didn't read a sign. I just ran in. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. Round frog, one diamond. White frogs, two diamond. Well, there isn't any. Green frog, two diamond. Though. I think they're still There's in production none. stages. This is a scam. I feel Me too. free lead per frog. Oh neat. Cute shop. It's a really cute also, shop. Uh right here. I'm giving you till I say go to take whatever you want from the sugar. Okay. When do I when do I start? Whenever. Okay. Well, I guess I'll start now. Go. Neat. Thank you. You're gonna have to take oh. it. Okay, thank you. Fuck okay, wow. it. You know what? <laughs> okay. Pop off. I'm mean, gonna have the inventory oh, space. No, no, oh, wait, I have shulker boxes. New shulkers, you <laughs> Wow. Look at that. Wonderful. Full circle. Yeah. It is. And now I have an odd number of shulkers. You know what you've encouraged me to do? Oh, awesome. Busy. Business. You making diamonds. Hell <laughs> yeah, Get myself a new ender chest. Jason. Hi. I was gonna start selling ender chests at my shop, but you make an ender chest stand. No, I, I mean, I don't I don't have that many ender chests. No? No. I, I'm gonna make a wood shop here in a little bit. Shop, yeah, I'm off. I have to build a wood farm first. <laughs> Would you like all of my sap? I already have sapling. Thank you. The farm makes a lot of saplings. <laughs> I only need one to start and then I'm set from there. One sapling. As long as I have one of each type. The only thing I can't make is dark oak. Can is just not very good at dark oak. This is your comp. It is and I cannot compete. So what I'm relying on is someone buys them out and then I can sell. Three sex string. Can you put that on each chest maybe? I do not have any left on me. Why? Ooh, ow. I've ended yeah. up in a place. This is getting more and more dangerous. It's like deteriorating. I really do like shop. Don't tell me you're gonna buy them out. I'm checking to see how. 17, oh, 18. 
Oh, oh no, I'm here. Eat. You know what? Fuck it. Um. Oh, I'm good at flying. Do you remember the last number I just said? I think it was 23. I honestly was focused on falling in the hole. Two. Don't ask. Why not? I want to stick. That's a lot of stuff. You never know when you need a stick, though. Danger. Turn back. Cave the dog fullest. Oh, it's don't turn back. Oh, I want some sign. It's a very specific reference. I don't know if anyone's going to get it, but I like it. There's string on the floor. Be careful. No. My inventory's full anyways. We live for very specific references. It's really hard to read. It, it follows along with the sign. Okay, it's say don't turn back. I'm not going to change it. The fact you can change signs now is a bit wild and all of our value. Oh, broke the item frame. All valuables and spare computer just froze. All right, so we are back in our industrial district and we're about to begin work on our next major farm. What is We'll be building ourselves a wood farm. This design is by Ian X04. I'll link it down in the video description. Uh, I have slightly modified it to allow me to place more saplings at once, uh, hopefully improving the drop rate just, just a tad. That's already a pretty efficient farm and great for this stage of the game. It doesn't require more materials than what's in this box, and I kind of went overboard in the amount of deep slate needed. It really only needs about that much. So just some extra building blocks just in case it never hurts, right? So we're gonna go ahead and begin a time lapse. We're gonna build it right down here, so it's right nearby here. So eventually at the top here we'll have a full and out storage area and like little collection afk area for various farms this one you'll actually have to act, uh, interact with actively but that's perfectly fine that's to be expected with this type of design so let's go ahead and get right into it It, but it does the trick. So at the top is a good old, very simple TNT duper. Uh, it doesn't use any slime blocks, corals, or anything, and I'm doing a really bad job trying to show it off. All right, there we go. Very simple TNT duper. This moves the TNT over for the larger tree types, like jungle oh, and brown mushrooms, as well as the nether trees. Um, I have to make sure this is actually on. Oh. The moment I turned it on, I fell. Um, yeah, and then down here, this is our good old timing circuit, which I realized I actually did not set up the timing for. And give me just a quick moment to do that. All right, now it's all set up down here. Uh, and it also has a lovely little lever over here for different types of tree types. Again, we can put this one down because we are working with our uh, oak saplings. Big notification I made here is it's three wide instead of the normal one wide, so I can grow three trees at once. But yeah, let's kick this thing started. I put some bow meal in, ready to go in here. Let's hope it works. All right. Oh, we have to turn on the circuit down here. This is the timer. What oh, activates the TNT upstairs. You can see a TNT come out. Yep, there comes a TNT. Doesn't get pushed. It falls. I'm getting hurt. All right, so I'm standing just ever so slightly too close. That's fine. All right, and let's turn this guy on so we get some bone meal and begin growing. Did I do something wrong? There shouldn't be a tree here. Uh -huh. Alright, I need to look into this. Alright, so I've done a little tweaking. I got rid of the two on the sides to blocks were getting stuck and you will get hurt in the process of this farm just because of how close the explosion is there isn't a ton you can do about it i, I added some blast protection the best but it does you know something ish uh you don't want to add too much or else it's going to block the actual farm and this even might be too much looking at it now eh, it wasn't doing a ton for me anyways yeah because it's going to block drops from getting down and in there actually same with this one here part of the issue all right well, i'm going to show you guys it working now i'm going to flip this thing on all right and start dropping tnt we can go ahead and start popping some of this in. All right, there's our first one. We just gotta be mindful of our health, which isn't the end of the world, and soon we'll get a beacon here and it won't be an issue. I'll probably get some proper last resistance armor. Make it even less of an issue. Ah, it's beating me. I did not seem to get the <laughs> sapling from before it blows up on me. Again. 
kind of a luck of the draw, it looks like. There might be something stuck up there. Yeah, there's some leaves up there. That might be good to turn this off and clean up the leaves. But let's see, just a couple, and we're already at a good amount of wood. I mean, I've only run through a couple trees myself, so not too bad. I think I'm just gonna sit here and try to farm some wood and see how it goes. Oh, so many other chests. All right, let's go. All right, so for five to 10 minutes of using the farm, uh, I did go through all my food, <laughs> but we got a good amount of wood. Uh, in the saplings department, it doesn't really give a good return on saplings, I'm not gonna lie, but it's fine. We're still getting some, and that's the important part. But this is going to be a pretty good farm. This kind of fuel a future shop of ours to really keep us going. I think we really might need to get a beacon because, oof, it's really hurting our armor. Doing good. Uh, this is just my mob farm. I need to pretty everything else up. Everything up. Everything's going to come up here eventually. And it's going to be a big storage area. But for now, just looks like this. My wood farm is right down here. It's the ENX04 design. Slightly, very slightly modified. Yes. Just include this uh oh i think i forgot to set that correctly all right well to include uh the bone meal hmm? this is a farm I'm oh wild um so for mangrove we need to add chains everywhere and it was very you like to see mine yeah i'd love to see yours let me figure out. let's just turn you up a little bit lead the way also is yours like really damaging your armor because mine's really damaging me um if you go too far forward it does yeah um, if you're if you're I, standing on this it will hurt you too much you gotta like stand a little further back it depends on what setting you have as well um, um, do you have it on small trees? Right now I have it on small trees, yes. Do you have it set small trees up top? I think so. I don't know which one, I don't know which one's the small tree setting. I think my sign is wrong. Okay, you've got it for, uh, if it's to the right, it's for big trees. Um, so if you've got it set for big trees and you have down the one at the bottom set for small trees, the explosions will happen really close to you and do a lot of damage. Hmm, so let's try it. Let's see how that turns, changes things if I turn it on. Oh, this is the problem I run into. Okay, so if you notice, it didn't actually get rid of the wood block. I don't know. Oh, I, that's the issue I keep running into. There's just something I might have set up wrong. Mm, one moment. Let's get it. Oh my god, I'm in. The crazy thing is, it works perfectly correctly in my creative world. Just not here. Don't have a stick with me. Do you have a stick? Yeah, I got a, I got a couple sticks. I'm just uh, schematic game. And you build it in the west direction, right? Hmm, everything seems right. Oh, one more. You are too low at the top by a block on each level. Oh, both of those are blocked too low? That would entirely do it. All right, so I guess I'll, I'll have to circle back and fix that in a little bit, won't I? You're also missing two slabs on the top of the scaffolding. I don't oh. know what the slabs are there for, but... I don't think the slabs are required. Oh, okay. But it being off I by one block would explain a lot. Um, block updates. I thought it might have been something to do with block updates. Awesome. And that's why they're there. Um, I need to find the way back to the uh, main area. Yeah, a block too low, right? Not a block too high? Yeah, a block too low. Alright, um, well I can fix that in a minute. Alright, come back up to the mob farm. Oh, there you are. So I'm nearly there. There you go. Make sure you add up here, yeah, that's all. I have too many arrows in here. Do you mind if I take a few bones for bone meal? Yeah, go for it. Big handful. Thank you. Uh, it's the one over here. Thank you. That's what's hurting my farm at the bone, me bone meal. Yeah. I mean, I've already eaten through like a chest worth. Uh, I've uh... It's this way. Are you okay flying? Yeah. Alright. Oh, here we go. Yeah, right here. Not too far away, but far enough, you know? Wait, is this a... Yeah, this is all right. I thought this was shopping then. Your house looks amazing. Thank you. Um, how are you with flying through one block holes? You manage. So that's the only way out. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Oh, wow. It's kind of funny we built so the this... same design. I see you have the chains going mm -hmm. on. Yeah, the chains um, stop the roots from the mangrove going everywhere in the in the build. Makes sense. And the walls at the side just to stop um, drops flying. getting caught on the side. Yeah. yeah, I need to add that to mine. But I've got a few. Oh, yeah. Seems to be going well for you. But the, that mangrove, those mangroves from like five trees and it's only 47 and i die nearly every time so sounds like mangroves just might be bit. easier to harvest by hand yeah but they're really annoying a duck oak might be easier to do by hand as well yeah 
that it's possible. I mean, you can do dark oak on the farm. I think you just have to replace the dirt every time. Yeah. Oh, it's a flower farm. Okay. It's a... Oh, it's uh, a moss farm. Moss farm. Yeah, so for bone meal. But it's not working properly at the moment. Keeps um you sending it all to here instead of going back up the farm. Yeah, sure. It's supposed to send it up to the farm and hold. Lock the, the hopper, but it's not locking the hopper. The redstone torch is right there to lock this hopper. It's just not doing it. Hmm. I mean, it's not, nothing's flowing out of it at the moment. No. Yeah, I've got this set up because at some point I'm going to switch to a uh, ice channel down to the chest instead of all these hoppers. There. But this is pretty nice. Yeah, I added the restocking section, which I don't think I'll need, but I do end up doing a long session there. So it sounds like I need to go fix up my farm. Oh, you're not here anymore. Hello, I'm here. Hello. Oh, I thought you left. Okay. But yeah, it sounds like I need to fix up mine. Move it a block up. Yeah, I need to fix this up so I can have some bone meal. Unless I can steal your bones constantly. I don't have that many <laughs> <Which> bones. Is... <laughs> sounds like we both have some work to do, though. Yeah. All right, I'll see you in a few. All right. That's about all I have time for today. If you enjoyed, be sure to subscribe and like the video. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. And I will be seeing you guys next time. Bye for now.